The Egyptian vulture is a small vulture which, when adult, has a distinctive black and white plumage. Since 2007, it has been on the red list of globally endangered species because of huge declines across most of its range in Europe, Africa, and Asia. Within the last 40 years, it has declined by over 50% in Europe and by 80% in the Balkans. There are a variety of human-related and natural causes for the decline, including hunting, persecution, and electrocution, and collision with power infrastructure. And like other vultures, inadvertent poisoning by veterinary drugs like diclofenac. Egyptian vultures also suffer from the lack of food in some areas, and some birds reared in Eastern Europe drown while making the sea crossing from Africa to Europe. In contrast to other countries, Oman appears to be a stronghold and safe haven for Egyptian vultures, both resident and migrant. Although more detail is needed, work supported by the Environment Society of Oman shows large nearly fourfold increases in the number of breeding pairs on Masira Island in recent times, ranking it as the second densest population of breeding Egyptian vulture in the world. Other ESO-supported work and reports by bird watchers highlight the large number, sometimes hundreds, of Egyptian vultures and other type of raptors. Unfortunately, the old practice of waste management in Oman involved the disposal and burning of waste in the, the traditional dump sites. We have about uh, 300 or more of these sites all over Oman and they are continuously releasing the contaminants into the surrounding environment including groundwater, soil and air. VIA was established to change this practice and uh, shut down all, all of those sites and replaced them with uh, 12 regional landfills. These landfills are engineered facilities and they are designed to isolate the waste from the surrounding environment. Uh, this will of course stop all the contaminants from being released and uh, this will protect the environment and human health for a better Omani life. Because of its stronghold status, Oman offers a unique portal to better understand the ecology and movement of birds and address basic questions important to their conservation. Do vultures seen in Oman move to other parts of the Middle East? How far do they travel to feeding sites in Oman? The best way to answer these such questions is through satellite tracking. We have made a start on this by tracking two young vultures captured in Al Multaka landfill in January 2015. Since then, they have moved between rubbish dumps in Muscat and Karayat and to villages along the coast. Although a start, these data are not sufficient and don't tell us anything about the vultures that come to Oman every autumn from Europe and Asia. We need to do more. Vultures breeding in Central Asia might be dependent on conservation in Oman. <laughs>